Birds are kind of famous for being beautiful. They have such interesting colors and shapes that people love looking at them. And some birds stand out above the rest. Let's look at some of the most beautiful birds in the world. The Pompadour Cotinga gets its color from a range of chemicals, including six unique pigments. The Asian emerald cuckoo is a brood parasite that lays its eggs in the nests of other birds. Pheasant-tailed jacanas eat small animals at the water's surface by swimming or walking on floating plants. Almost any hummingbird species could be in the most beautiful birds, but the crowned wood nymph is beautiful even among hummingbirds. The lilac-breasted roller is an African bird that watches for small animals to pass by, then swoops down to eat them. For future reference, falcated means curved like a scythe, like the falcated duck's tertial wing feathers. Nicobar pigeons not only have metallic-looking feathers that change from green to coppery, but I also love their bright orange toenails. Golden pheasant males have so many patches with different beautiful feathers, from red and yellow to blue and green. The gray-crowned crane is the national bird of both the Democratic Republic of Congo and Uganda. Himalayan monal pheasants live in mountains up to three miles above sea level. The hyacinth macaw is able to apply up to 1,500 pounds per square inch of force with its beak. Keel-billed toucans use their beaks to shed heat in their tropical rainforest homes. Here's another beautiful hummingbird, the fiery-throated hummingbird, native to South America. The pink cockatoo is a species of parrot that uses its crest for communication, both to indicate mood and as a warning. Mandarin ducks are a symbol of happy marriages in several Asian cultures. The painted bunting is a member of the cardinal family, but manages to have even more bright color than the cardinal. Indian peacocks have enormous feathers that they fan out. Their feathers can be up to six feet long. Snowy owls live all around the Arctic Circle, even living near the North Pole. Wood ducks nest high in trees, and their chicks jump all the way down to the ground just one day after hatching. It's an interesting introduction to the world. The pheasant kukul is native to Australia and has these beautiful wing feathers. Unlike many other cuckoos, this one raises its own young. The great Philippine eagle is only found on four islands in the world, and there are less than 500 left. The crested peacock pheasant puts a metallic dot on so many of its feathers. Nice! The secretary bird is like a walking eagle that kicks its prey before eating it. Do not mess with this bird. Sunbirds are another group where most of the members are beautiful. The variable sunbird is a fine representative with its shiny feathers. The crested fireback has both structural blue feathers and structural blue skin. Domestic chickens are a subspecies of the beautiful red jungle fowl, native to Asia. Red-tailed tropic birds nest on beautiful islands, and their soaring flight makes the islands that much more beautiful. We're seeing a lot of pheasants in this group, but ring-necked pheasants are both beautiful and different than other pheasants. Sun conures are a bright and beautiful species of parrot native to South America, but they are very noisy. And lastly, Gouldian finches are a colorful Australian seed-eating species of bird. Thank you for taking a tour of some of the most beautiful birds in the world. Are there some that you would have added to this list? If we get enough suggestions, I'll make another volume of beautiful birds. You can subscribe to know when that comes out. Thanks for stopping by this week to learn what makes life awesome.